Jay? Jay has uh, got great energy. We were just talking about it in the car out here this morning. He's, he's just always got the same energy from the early morning till night. He never really wanes, and that's very important. Jay is wonderful because he's nurturing and um, I don't know, there's been a couple times when he's given me certain points, pointers that I've been like, I wasn't sure about and then I would try them out and I'd realize he was absolutely correct. And I think it's because he's written this character and there's probably a piece of him in there, probably a lot of pieces of him. So I'm beginning, I, I really trust him, I trust his eye. But I bet you tip the belly dancer. Sorry about the other night. I didn't get you any trouble, did I? No. Yes. Is it okay? Oh, no, it hurts so bad. I get these seizures now. It shouldn't have hit me so hard. I think that you and I should have some casual cuddling. And we'll keep it a secret. We won't tell anybody. What do you think? The uh, Kurds are pushed around by three uh, states because, as you know, part of Kurdistan is here, part of Kurdistan is there, and part of it is, is there. Uh, so while they have a lot of common with the Jews, you know, they are also have a lot of common because with the Middle East because they are Muslims. But their cause has never really been highlighted. I was engineer in Kurdistan. Each time we build bridge, Saddam, bomb, bomb, bomb. Now, eh? talk, talk, talk. Oh, oh. <laughs> Bismillah. 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 Oh, may I have? Hey, ask me, why Israel throw you Christians and Muslims out of your homes and give them to settlers uh, from Russia and, and, and Florida? Huh? Ask me. Why? Obviously, the, the political situation is ripe for a story like this, which hopefully can bring together people. I'm curious because it actually really delves deeply, which, you know, especially like bringing the Muslim uh, side into, into the story and, and, and it just brings up a lot of issues, so it'll be interesting. I love actors. I, I studied acting in London, um, and each one is different. Their approach is different, so you, you, you just um, work with each one differently. Um, listen to them, and they bring something extra. Often on the set, I rewrote the lines um, because I would discuss it with the actors. The gate the ring back. Well, yeah. what it is, Jay, is, yeah. is it shoved in my butt. I know, that's There's nowhere else to carry it. Right. So it's sort of like yeah, very yeah. awkward <laughs> yeah. throughout the whole scene. And then yeah, like yeah. I reach out of my butt well, and I how give do it to you, Yeah. Well, so how do we work this out? Let me see. Let me we can see. keep it here yeah. on, the, on this thing. Maybe yeah. did he come out and set the bench up maybe? Like maybe there's one rose here and I have the rest with me? Or yeah. Yeah. I, no, I understand what you're saying. I'm just trying to see. We haven't seen you with a jacket on. Layla, I am uh, I'm going nuts. I mean, this is like something out of a movie here. I am blinded by love, and you are the only thing I can see. Would you do me the uh, pleasure of hanging out with me forever? <laughs> you want to marry me forever? Would you do me the honor? of becoming Muslim? No, <laughs> Jesus, no. 
So we're gonna have moody light here by the trees where they first start. And he proposes to her the romantic moment. And when she raises the issue of him converting, he snaps out of, gets up, snaps out of the romantic light. Going this way, she chases him, goes into the less romantic light. I'm crazy about you, but, but no, no, I'm, I'm agnostic. You gotta, I love you, but... I love you too, but I don't want to be agnostic. They exist? <laughs> well, you gonna put that in the... <laughs> if you're my Majnun, my family must know I marry a peaceful Muslim. They exist? What? Nothing. Peaceful Muslim. They exist? <laughs> well, you gonna put that in the... <laughs> <laughs> if you're my Majnun, my family must know I marry a peaceful Muslim. They exist? What? Nothing. He seems very um, calm and he knows what he wants. Mm -hmm. And so it's reassuring. Because, <laughs> you know, uh, as an actor, I'm like a little bit all over the place. What, what about this? What about that? And, he's, and so he kind of directs, me, okay, this is good, this is not, this is too much, this is not. And it's a calm, he has a very calming effect. It's, mm -hmm. it's good. This was one of the best music experiences I've had in film. Um, Jay is very creative, very open-minded. He encouraged me to try a lot of different things, and he encouraged me to play uh, a number of different instruments. He has a love of life, and, and, and uh, uh, just uh, it feels good to be around him. He also knows the story very well. Jay, this is uh, Dorit, she's our belly dancer. This is Harlan, our DP. Hi. Jay, our director. Oh, yeah. Um, just, just show this color to see what you think. Yeah. And, we, and she has a blue one. A turquoise. Is it turquoise? That's great. The colors are great. Yeah. Cool. That's great. That's great. Thanks a lot. Just stay by. Yeah, you know, we're gonna do some blocking. Just sit uh, over to the left here. Thanks. So this on Tortoleta, what we have is this thing behind these two, kind of wider. And we have the other one which be tighter. There's no. There's like no comparison here. <laughs> if I were him, I'd be like... That's why she gets all the tips. That's why she gets all the tips. Wait a second. That's your greatest line in the whole thing.